One bright and sunny morning, Pickrob rolls into Sonderman Park on his rascal stolen from Walmart. Pickrob looks around for a bench to sit at and eventually hobbles to a rusty bench. He struggles to sit down with his large oxygen tank lent to him by Solstice. The sounds of children can be heard in close proximity. Pickrob reaches into his lunchbox to retrieve a cupcake. He loudly chews and munches on it while staring at a passing child. Pickrob begins getting upset at the child as it nears him. Pickrob raises his voice at the child. Get out of here, you troll! You're not getting my cupcake! The young child cries and runs away. Pickrob returns to consuming his cupcake while moaning. A rustling can be heard in a bush nearby. Pickrob turns to the noise and covers his cupcake with his large hands. Chris Hansen appears out of the bush. Chris walks over to Pickrob and sits next to him. Mr. Piccone, why are you sitting at the park all alone and eating a cupcake? asks Chris Hansen. Pickrob begins to turn red in his face like a tomato and grunts and hollers. Who are you? Are you a troll sent by Rywin? Chris Hansen points to his camera hidden in the bushes and explains to Pickrob. Well, Mr. Piccone, I am Chris Hansen of Dateline NBC, and I'm doing an investigation into talking to minors online, and we have evidence provided by a lollipop cop. Robbie staggers off his chair and yells, Go away, troll! I'm not sitting here and letting you troll me! I'm leaving! Robbie s stands up and gets onto his rascal and begins to drive away. Then from the bushes emerges 33 police officers, all from the El Paso County Police Department. One officer yells to pick her up to pull over but does not comply, Robbie. Pickrob begins a police chase and starts live streaming. Pickrob starts screaming and yelling, but the audio is completely inaudible. Eventually, you can make out from this yelling, Damn it, Cave Squeaker! Get your stupid trolls away from me! Mistaking the phone for a weapon, an officer fires at Pickrob's rascal, hitting his oxygen tank and causing a huge explosion. Pickrob is reduced to a pile of grease and lard. From the distance emerges Noel, the green-eyed wolf, crying. He rushes to Pickrob's grease trap and cries about his loyalty to Pickrob. Noel scoops up Pickrob's grease into his head and vows to bring Pickrob back to his former self. <laughs>